A shelled creature slowly creeps along the ground. Species found in rivers, gardens and beaches. The snail shell is everywhere. These incredibly slow creatures have shells for a reason. So, let's find out why snails have shells. Snails come in all sorts of shapes and sizes. Almost every species has a different appearance, but what they all possess are shells. But what are they and what's their purpose? A snail's shell grows with the snail and contains calcium carbonate, which is important to build the shell and keep it strong. The shell is its exoskeleton. Snail shells provide protection as they are hard enough to prevent damage from small predators. Some are incredibly hard, which even bigger predators can't break. When a snail is in danger, its soft body goes into the shell, which is fused to the body via muscles. Mucus makes their skin slippery, so they can quickly retreat inside. A snail's shell not only provides protection for the snail's main body, but also does so for its internal organs. The snail's beating heart, intestines and other organs are all located inside its shell. Not only do snails have shells, but so do other mollusks. Some slugs have internal shells and invertebrates such as clams and bivalves, crabs and more possess these defensive casings. Even vertebrates such as chelonians and armadillos have them, a remarkable example of convergent evolution. Snails are cute to me and hopefully now to you. And that concludes the second season's premiere of Inverts for Dummies. If you learned something new, consider subscribing so as to not miss new episodes. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and goodbye.